Carroll Pool Recreation Department held its sixth annual Harvest Festival on Saturday, October 2nd at Stone Field. Until this year, the event was known as Jarvis Harvest due to its typical location at Jarvis Farm on Common Street. Walpole's Director of Recreation, Brendan Croak, explains that the venue change was to accommodate what organizers anticipated to be a larger than usual crowd. Normally it's actually called Jarvis Harvest because it takes place down at Jarvis Farm in Walpole. Um, this year we moved it to a larger location to accommodate some of the larger crowds than we anticipated. Awesome, great. And was that because of just the pandemic and everything going on here you yeah, expected? Yeah, so we took a year off because of the pandemic and we figured a lot of people are going to be antsy to come out, anxious and, and you know, have a day with their families. So um, clearly the crowds came out here and, and turned up in a, a, a large capacity. Kids enjoyed a variety of inflatable games and had the opportunity to explore inside a Walpole fire engine. The trackless train ride was another fan favorite. We're camp counselors during the summer and then we do the soccer program and help out during like events. Um, but today we're helping out with the games around the perimeter and we're helping control the lines of the train and make sure everything runs smoothly. Booths featuring some local businesses and Walpole-based organizations were available for folks to browse, while Hungry Festival goers got a bite to eat from Pete's Pushcarts, a Watertown-based street food business. The event also featured a live performance from local cover band Southbound Train. I think it was a, it's a pretty big crowd. We had a lot of uh, little kids that are enjoying all the games and everything, and a lot of adults that are walking them through and purchasing things from the tents and the, all the vendors. With Harvest Fest 2021 in the books, Croke looks forward to the Recreation Department's next event this spring. We're looking to do Waffle Day in May, um, so keep your eyes open for that. And uh, other than that, we'll see everybody. Uh, see everybody then.